Uh, hi, my name is Michael Weinrock. Um, well, I think heart disease is still one of the number one killers in this country of Americans. Uh, and the idea is, can we prevent people from dying before they should from heart disease? So preventive cardiology is trying to identify people who are at risk, even if they don't have symptoms. Identify them early, try to modify things both lifestyle-wise, maybe pharmacologically-wise, to prevent the development of heart attack. Oftentimes when a patient will present with chest discomfort or shortness of breath with exertion, we, based on how they describe their symptoms, have a general idea before we do a test of whether we think this could be from the heart or not. Uh, stress testing is a way to try to decide, for, to help the physician decide whether the symptoms are in fact coming from the heart or not. The problem with a regular stress test is it often has some false positives and false negatives, which in English means that it, its accuracy is limited. Sometimes it's abnormal when there really isn't disease, and sometimes it's normal when there is disease. Stress echocardiography is a way to improve the accuracy of a regular stress test. I feel one of the added benefits of a stress echocardiogram is that it's a, a shorter test than a nuclear stress test. It doesn't involve any uh, radiation exposure. It doesn't involve inserting an IV in most cases. Uh, and you get an answer right away. We're able to, to tell you the answer right there in the room. Before you leave, you don't have to get a phone call later and wait for the results.